Alrighty guys, Sadsy the Clown back once again for another unboxing video. Today I have, from Sideshow Collectibles, the G.I. Joe Storm Shadow 1 6th figure. Um, this one actually is a thanks to a local like uh, pop culture store, OMG Tech, because they had a costume competition. I went dressed as my man Sub-Zero and managed to get enough likes to win a voucher which went towards this bad boy. So thanks guys for this. So yeah, let's just check it out. Let's get straight into it. From the front here, you've got a little beautiful artwork. Beautiful. As once again, the box is fantastic. You've got the beautiful logo. The sweet, sweet imagery of the actual figure itself. Storm Shadow, Cobra, Cobra Enemy on the front there, and Six Scale with the Sideshow logo. Awesome. Normal details on the bottom. On the side, you've got a sweet another image with this great uh, classic background behind him. Same on the other side, different pose. And then on the back, Bit of information, you've got uh, a few other accessories he comes with on this side here. Licensed by Hasbro. And a write-up. So if I hold that there, it's not going to be very clear, but if you want to pause it on there, you can read that out to yourself. Okay, beautiful magnet box, like always. Pull that open. Oh, that's what we want! Boom! Right in there, guys. Storm Shadow. Once again, there's another write-up. I'll hold that still for a second, and you can pause that and probably try and read it. Other than that, here he is, guys. Window at the front, which is lovely, so if you wanted to keep it in the packet, which I don't know why you would, you could. There's the window. Let's get him out. Okay, we've got the box off, guys. Let's slip this out of here. Ooh, be gentle. We'll slide that out, and how good is that? I spotted that through the packet before. You can't even see it barely when it's in there. Lovely artwork. Cobra Commander had that on the inside of his. Beautiful. So this is Storm Shadow in his finest. Uh, I don't know a lot. I don't. These could be dodgy facts I'm giving you right now, but Sideshow Collectibles have already made a Storm Shadow in his completely original, fully white costume. This is their second Storm Shadow, which I found out is based on I think the second series of the original, G not the original, but the little GI Joe. Uh, I don't know what scale, uh, but the small GI Joe figures. So that's about it. Um, and even though this says Cobra Enemy, I did a little bit of research and it sounds like when he wears these clothing, he's no longer Cobra. So, I don't know, let me know in the comments. I don't know a whole lot about that. But this is what the packet looks like, guys. Two, uh, two clear trays. On the back there you can see all the weapons and the stand. On the front there you've got Storm Shadow, the man Storm Shadow. <clears throat> so, let's get him out. Oh, this is strong! Alright, let's have a quick look at him, guys. So this is the full costume here. The the mask is separate to the face, which is fantastic. It looks like the eyeballs are, just like on Cobra Commander. The helmet, the head is sculpted, but sculpted beautifully. Like, it looks like material, it looks lovely. They've got all the joins and details and creases in there, which is nice. Looks like he's got an undershirt on, because you can see... Uh, the white covering his neck there. He's got like a turtleneck sort of stretch material on. He has a awesome shirt which has a hoodie and in the hoodie you've got some wire so you can pose that to actually look like a hood. <laughs> so that's good. That's beautiful. He's got a vest over the top of this shirt uh, with some clips on there which looks like where his sword will go in the back and a clip around the waist just looks, it seems. A belt. <laughs> okay, he's got two gauntlets on there, and if you look underneath this gauntlet, urgh, I can only just see it, but you can see the clan symbol, which, like a noob, I can't remember what it's called, but you can see his clan symbol tattooed on his arm, just like Snake Eyes. He's got the hands, standard, uh, standard pants on there, front knee pads, and feet. Shoes, whatever you want to call them. Let's quickly check out the articulation. He's got the full... His feet can go any direction. Beautiful. His knees... Are double jointed by the feel of it. Two or one joint. Could be one. Look at these. Look at his... He can almost do the splits. Because his pants are baggy, he can almost do the splits. Which is sweet. Do they have double jointed or single jointed elbows though? Just single. Well that's... 
probably going to be enough movement for the items he comes with. I do like the double jointed though, I've got to say. The double jointed elbows and things are so nice. Looks like he's got a bit of an ab rocker there as well. And full head movement. This, the... Oh, the articulation's beautiful on this, guys. So that's pretty well how the figure is. Let's go over some of these accessories and we'll check them out. Storm Shadow comes with a total, including the two hands that are on him, it comes with a total of nine hands. So on him you've got one fist hand, the other hand looks like it's designed to hold uh, the sword, I'd say, or, or items like the sword. Then you've got an open uh, clutch, not an open grabbing sort of hand. You've got another another hand capable of holding the sword or the, uh, I don't even know what they're called, the other ninja weapons. You've got a chopping hand. Hoya! You've got just a, here, grab my hand kind of hand. You've got the, the two finger pull for the, the bow and arrow, or the compound bow. You've got the hand holding the ninja star. That ninja star is surprisingly sharp. And then you've got the hand in a fist with the ninja claw on it. You don't want to squeeze this claw because this feels a bit... It looks beautiful, it's pointy, but if you squeeze it, I think you'd snap those things. But it looks amazing. So that's the hands. Okay, it comes with a backpack, which obviously goes straight on in there. The backpack's capable of holding some of the weapons, um, which I'll show you on the figure later. So that's the backpack. Let's just quickly check this. With working zips, turns out. So, yeah, I'm not going to do them all the way, but looks like the zips work. Okay, you've also got a rope to go around his chest. The beautiful thing about the rope is it's permanently in this position here, and it is wire-filled. I didn't realise it was going to be like that, so you can bend it to sit where you want, and it will stay where you want. That is awesome. He comes with these two ninja weapons, which someone can tell me in the comments, because I don't know what they're called, but they look sweet. They're made of plastic, but they do look like timber, so they've done an amazing job on the sculpt and the paintwork on those. You've got this fantastic compound bow, which actually works. That is beautiful. The paint job is nice. It's got like your urban, I'd call it urban camo, to tell you the truth. Sco it. This is nice. Like, I don't know not a lot about these, but... It looks like what I've seen in the shops. It looks good. It looks beautiful. Also comes with four arrows for the bow. Wonder if it can actually shoot them. Don't know. Doesn't feel like it's got the tension to do that. Twing. But yeah, so that's sweet. So you've got four arrows and the bow. And then lastly, lastly, but bestly, <laughs> that's not even a word, but here we go. His katana. How awesome is this? It comes with a sheath to go in. Which also, the sheath has the, I wish I knew the name of the frickin' uh, clan logo, but you've got the logo on there, you've got the logo on the blade there, and then you've got all these other inscriptions on the blade. And the blade is metal! Gotta be happy with that. And that there, should in theory, slide into that. Which it does. Sword fits perfectly in the sheath. I love it. I love it. So that's all the gear, guys. Let's get it on him and have a proper look at him. Alright, so I've managed to load him completely up. Here he is, Storm Shadow in the bulk. Look at him here, guys. Look at this. So we've got all the gear. We've got the rope going around the chest there. We've got the backpack on. Got him in a sweet action pose. Got the bow ready to take down a killer headshot. Um, I'll show you the back. So this is the sweet thing about the backpack. Backpack was a little bit tricky to get on, but now I've got it on, it seems to be sitting alright. Uh, the katana goes through underneath, which is sweet. The arrows go in the top here, which um, which were actually a little bit trickier to get in there because they are quite flimsy and you don't want to break anything like this. So the arrows are in there. These two wooden, I wish they knew what they were called, but the wooden stick things slide into the side of the backpack, which is perfection. They've really done a good job with this, guys. This is up there as my favorite one so far that I've got. Um, gotta get hold of a snake eyes and see what that's like. But other than that, this is truly beautiful. I love it. I think I'm more of a fan of having the hood down than over his head though. 
uh, just because I can't quite get that to look how I want it to look. Um, it's just going to take a bit more time to fiddle around, I think. Other than that, guys, that's what he looks like. So that's the finished piece. <sighs> Beautiful. I highly recommend him. If you're a fan of uh, G.I. Joe and you're a fan of Storm Shadow, you will love this. Alrighty, guys. Well, thanks for watching. I've been Sassy the Clown, and you've been watching the unboxing of the Sideshow Collectibles 1 6 scale Storm Shadow action figure, I guess you call them. Uh, this isn't the only G.I. Joe action figure I've unboxed. I've unboxed a Cobra Commander. Cobra! So check that out. I've also unlo uh, unlocked, I've unlocked it, I've unboxed a Cobra Commander Desert Ops Officer, the equivalent of a Storm Trooper, trooper but in the uh, G.I. Joe world. Please go back and check that out. Hit the like and subscribe. I don't know if I said that, but I'll say it again. That's about it. So if you didn't know what a G.I. Joe Storm Shadow looks like out of the box, now you know, and knowing, it's half the battle. Catch you in the next video.